Hey guys, welcome back to I Read Your Comments. Today is Friday and I'm only recording, well, maybe two videos. Maybe this one. Um, I mean, this one for sure because I'm doing it right now. So, <laughs> oh boy. Uh, and Blood Fresh Supply. And uh, on Monday, if everything works out well, then I'm gonna record on Monday the next XCOM U for defense uh, part, which will be very, very interesting. The reason I don't wanna do this today is simple. I'm so deeply into uh, Blender. Uh, when I say that, I mean, it's not my goal to, to become a, a 3D artist or something like this, but right now it's a lot of fun to just um, do the one animation I'm, I'm working on. And uh, well, it, it takes away a huge junk of uh, time. And so I just work on it. And for that reason, no XCOM video today. Uh, but I tried to release this on Monday. Anyways, to be ready on Monday, I thought let's uh, do the I read your comment video because then I'm gonna be well prepared on Monday, hopefully. Okay, without further ado, let's start with um, Gabriel C. Although one thing I want to say, sometimes I will not respond. I mean, I read every comment, that's for sure. Uh, but sometimes I will not always respond to when you guys read um, um, the when you guys write me a comment in the comment video section, otherwise it will never end. So, <laughs> um, so but I'm reading everything. Okay, when I say I will not respond, I mean uh, with a comment video. Uh, otherwise I'm gonna be in the loop, right? Okay, now uh, enough uh, talk. Let's start reading the comments. Gabriel C. Um, says, I would love to see the behavior logic for the civilian AI I be there's oh good there was a small cut I because I think this one he means I bet right I'm not sure I, I just took a guess so Gabriel says I would love to see the behavior logic for the civilian AI I bet and I think this is a shortcut there is a suicide function in there somewhere probably I guess so yeah those <laughs> I mean yeah well, I mean you know if it, that's not so unrealistic, actually. If they are panicking, you know, they are just don't know what to do, and they, you know, some start running and some sleep. Um, the next comment is from Logan Shu. Getting shot is frust. Ah, hold on, this one here. Getting shot is frustrating to you, but it is entertaining for us. Poor Lucy is going through a tough time, but at least she is still alive. Unlike, unlike Daily Updog, you did not waste any medic, medikit judge, uh, charges. It looks like you did need to use two stimulant, stimulant charges to res, no, resuscitate. <laughs> Let me check this word quickly. To resuscitate, uh, vis -vis, oh, sorry, I bumped against the microphone. To resuscitate uh, her, um, cool word. You may actually need to use more because it still looks like Lucy is going to pass out again soon. Her health is low and her stun damage is close to passing it since you are still standing in smoke. Yeah, I mean, yeah, um, that's... I mean, on the one hand, I want to say, yeah, it, it, the game definitely has the potential to do, to be frustrating. But every good game has that. Um, I mean, you know, some games who are only frustrating, there is, yeah, it's just some games are really bad games. But this is not one of them. So, yeah, I can see it's frustrating sometimes. Um, <laughs> but I also appreciate uh, that it's entertaining for you. I mean, you know, this is the... Well, this is my main goal, actually, to be entertaining uh, uh, for you. So that's good. Absolutely. And about um, Lucy, yeah, she's going through a lot. That's completely true uh, in this part. And I try to take care of her. I should write some points down, I think. Yeah, that's good. Let's write some points down and make a cut, a small one. So, okay, uh, sometimes I'm gonna make a cut and sometimes I'm just uh, pausing the recording, which you can do with um, OBS. And pausing the recording is very cool to do. I just wanna say that the open broadcast uh, software, which is free for everybody, 
is very cool. So that's just uh, something I would like to mention. Anyway, okay, point one is Lucy is going to pass out. So this is point one. Uh, point, oh yeah, I talked too fast. Point one is Lucy is going to pass out. So next thing. Um, not to scare you even more, but I think there may be a third alien di directly north of Lucy's position on the one no on the alien turn at uh, fifth, uh, 54 and 50 seconds a shot came from the gar garden area and killed uh, the civilian that you tried to protect with the smoke you thought it was the alien in the warehouse that killed him but to me this looked like a different alien uh, then the one in the warehouse okay this is the next point okay i prepared this here so um uh, uh blah, 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 logan almost forgot the name sorry uh, uh is talking about what happens here so i'm just turning the volume down and now this one i think it already happened Let's go back again just quickly and I'm sorry that I'm I'm with sound. <laughs> that was if you mean that, that was very fast. Um to be honest. So interesting. Um and I would say uh that I I mean I did this already. I wrote down point two is third alien, so um maybe I should write north. North uh, garden okay because i mean i really don't want to mess this up you know on the one hand yeah it's okay it's a it's a tough uh, mission but if it's possible to to do it good i try it of course okay um uh da -da -da. aha the civilians are just asking to die by just standing in between you and the aliens all the time now i get it i had a little bit struggle with the sentence but yeah yeah i think so talking um no oh this is really good yeah i i, I remember this taking the shot you can mean both that you are making the shot or getting shot it is an ambig oh boy it is ambiguous methodic uh it depends on the context of the surrounding sentence to determine which one you mean for example if you say he has good accuracy i'm going to have him take the shot we can tell you mean your soldier is shooting but if you say my tank is tough he will be able to take the shot then we know you mean getting shot yeah, I mean, that's really good because context things uh, are difficult sometimes because um, I, I don't even remember that I've learned this kind of sentence. This is a sentence you just subconsciously get it and then you're using it and then you're using it in a different context because you still think it's okay and this is really confusing. I don't know how to describe that better right now, but I think that uh, context things are, are a little bit tricky sometimes. Um, so I'm, I'm very happy about that because... Uh, I was really f deeply thinking uh, during the gameplay. Is this what, what a weird sentence? <laughs> okay. Um, then we have a explosion will destroy any other grenades in the area, so they will not explode. So you cannot stack grenades for extra damage. Absolutely. Um, this is something I. I it. it occurred to me later that i mean yeah I, first of all i think it, it already happened although i'm not sure with explosive grenades uh but i mean it's yeah i, I mean i wasn't i wasn't 100 sure but i thought afterwards well it's m very likely that the grenade just explode because everything else does as well you know so like yeah but still it's very good to read that so i'm, I'm sure now then we have uh, one hour five minutes and 45 uh, you can uh, control click to force fire in the direction of the spot you click even if there is no direct line of of fire to to 
that spot or just click on the wall next to the alien you have line of fire to the wall yeah i would say reload is fine in this case since you didn't mean to shoot to shoot at the time okay i have to check the okay now it's clear why you said i would say reload is fine in this case since you didn't mean to shoot at the time um and this is why timestamps so so helpful i don't need them all the time sometimes i know when you uh, what you uh, what you are speaking about or speaking of uh, but in this case uh, it, it became more clear so um, logan talks about the situation where i tried to kill the alien which is staying behind the wall and uh, i tried to shoot at this direction Direction and the game told me there was no line of fire and then I just wanted to see the game highlights the obstacles in the uh, when there is no line of fire the game is highlighting every obstacle in the in the way when you press firing so I try to do that uh, to see the obstacle by pressing firing and I, 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 I took the shot and uh, well it wasn't I mean it, it were going in the right direction somehow but not in the exact right direction so that it felt like a kind of a wasted shot uh, it's good that I could have reloaded that I wasn't sure but I have to say it's kind of my um, fault because I just um, could have a little bit slowed down before I clicked like a maniac to, to shoot in this direction so but yeah i mean you know if you don't intend to do stuff i think reloading is uh, okay from time to time so but it's good to know and i could control click to force uh, a fire is, is very good but i would i would be scared to to just blow up myself right if there's an obstacle in the way in the force fire i make I, I take the shot i make the shot but i probably blow up the obstacle as well right I guess so okay next thing is your soldiers will take damage if you end the turn standing in fire unless you have power armor so i cut a little bit because i was talking too long about that uh about the power armor um that's good to know it's a very very vital hint uh, because i thought in the last part that it will not uh, affect uh, a soldier i believe they the updock were standing in fire so because uh, we only get the damage if if the turn is uh, in the next turn basically uh, i thought we fire would not be a problem but it's also good to know that power armor will uh, protect us okay before i talk too much about power armor and, and fallout let's continue with gabriel c and is this correct is this still in the right order yeah i think so and gabriel c is uh, uh, says it's like 10 minutes later and i'm still chuckling about your monologue about doors being the scariest enemies in the game well it's definitely true for me it's <laughs> i i struggle so hard with those doors they are so mean to me and i'm gonna get my revenge my revenge revenge is, uh, is, is revenge does this work in the english language as well i mean you can use this in the german language uh, but it, the, or, the origin comes is, is, is french i believe right yeah i think so i do think so okay um then logan shoe and yeah i think that's funny <laughs> and logan shoe throwing grenades from inside a house is difficult because there is a ceiling need room to have the arc for the grenade uh, path yeah i think that's that's true uh, it kind of I mean, although it's clear, uh, you sometimes, uh, I mean, sometimes you in general, you sometimes uh, forget that the building is still kind of there because um, I only see the, the first floor um, or level, uh, but the building was, uh, yeah, I think, but, but I, I tried again, uh, uh, further, uh, you need, yeah, more room to have the arc will probably help me so to throw the grenade over that or, or, or whatever i i want to throw it and then gabriel c says yeah xcom is is this on yeah i hope that's all not uh, let's reload the, the page sometimes it's a little bit tricky you know i i rather reload the page so i have to change this one to the f sometimes the the read more button is just not there you know okay uh but it seems to be okay yeah xcom is basically the video game adaption of 
Ah, this is the reply. Okay, we have to read Hjotlaik's comment first because he... Gabriel is replying to that. Okay, that makes more sense. Hjotlaik says, uh, So you got a soldier killed. I've done that thousand literally of times. You'll get used to it. Uh, there is no mistake that you make that I haven't done bef before myself. Accidentally shooting uh, a rocket when just aiming check done that forgetting to reload a rocket launcher check done that also all the future mistakes you are about to do check done that as well yeah i think you know what is um that's why i i uh, I, I i said i mean the, the game is frustrating but what's very important is it's fair at the same time so every mistake is or every or I think, I'm not sure about that because I just don't know the game well enough. But so far, I've played, I can say, every mistake I made or every bad thing what happened felt kind uh, like uh, my mistake and uh, felt like, okay, you can do that better. And that's good, you know, if you make a mistake but you see how you could make it better, that's you know that's really good and it's it's motivating if if you if you try your best and then you do your best and you're still failing that's that would be very bad and it probably happens here as well at some point but if this doesn't happen too often that's totally fine but this is what what really frustrates me if you do your best and you you you, you try to do it well but the game seems to be weird uh not xcom i'm just speaking in general uh, that is something what frustrates me very well. But so far, it's my fault, and that's painful still because <laughs> it it hurts. But it's okay. Um, so whenever frustration sets in, remember it's XCOM when soldiers have one too few time units to shoot. It's XCOM when you shoot and miss an alien, the alien reaction fires back and kills you. It's XCOM. Yeah, okay, that's <laughs> whatever goes wrong, whenever it, whenever it goes wrong, however it goes wrong, it's XCOM. Okay, well, and this is okay again. If I said uh, when when a game is being unfair, but you know, it a little bit of of, of unpredictable things is okay. So it's it's about the the balance, I, I guess. So I get what you mean. I get what you mean. When you learn to love the pain, you will learn to love the game. Is it is it okay to use civilians as an obstacle? Ah, yeah, this is what I what I what I asked. Yeah, this is. <laughs> I become desperate in a way. So I yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, lol, I love your thinking the, here. Just remember that after the alien misses the civilian, the civilian runs away, leaving your face to face with an alien. It's XCOM. Uh, the civilian runs away, leaving your face to face with an alien. It's XCOM. Okay, uh, by the way, yes, proximity grenades are sensitive to movement any movement if it moves the proxy will blow up no matter if it's an alien if it's an alien your soldier or a civilian or your tank for that matter ah okay okay well that's completely clear now so thanks for that it's very very nice and thanks for that um also it's very mo motivate mo your it's very motivational um Oh boy, your 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 speech or your your text is where your comment is very motivating. Ah, here we go, motivating. Uh, because although I think it's okay to, to fail, it's good that that you guys say that. Um, and daily up talk. <laughs> uh, you can rebuild me better, faster, stronger than before, and I will do that. Of course, you gonna you gonna be a, a killing machine, a mutant killing machine. <laughs> Yeah, um, it's strange because it's it's really um, on the one hand the game doesn't look very impressive from the graphic. Uh, speaking of the graphics, but the the feelings are deep <laughs> when you lose and soldier, so that's good. Okay, we continue on on Monday, so I only have like two points written down. That's not much. I probably forget something, um, but I think we we can do it. You know, in the next part, I um, have to remember that there may be free 
aliens. I'm not sure um, if the one alien we threw a grenade at, um, if, if this alien survived or not. I just do not know that. So that, that'll be interesting and I'm gonna take my time for the next part on Monday. Okay, now I think I'm not even sure if I record blood for supply because it's already evening uh, late and I'm hungry. So Blender is really a, taking a little bit time away, but that's okay, I guess. Well, we'll see about that. Okay, guys, um, thanks for the comments and uh, I wish you a good weekend and I hope you are okay and everybody, you know, you know what I mean, I guess. And well, stay safe, uh, have a good weekend. And until the next part, bye bye and auf Wiedersehen. Oh, Wiedersehen. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot uh, Gabriel's reply to Shot Likes uh, comment, um, which is here. And he says, yeah, XCOM is basically a video game adaption of Occam's Oca Razor, which I don't really know what it is. Uh, it's supposed to go wrong. Laugh my ass off. <laughs> this is this one I do know. Uh, well, again, this is motivating because you know that keeps me going. So um, it's good to know that things have to go wrong. Uh, okay, good. I'm sorry that I forgot to read a comment, and now I'm saying goodbye. Uh, stay safe, guys. Have a good one. Until the next part. Bye bye. And of Wiedersehen. Oh.